twin sister and defender of the Crystal Castle. This is Spirit, my beloved steed. Fabulous secrets were revealed to me the day I held aloft my sword and said, For the honor of Grayskull! A few others share this secret. Among them are Light Hope, Madam Raz, and Cowl. Together, we and my friends of the Great Rebellion strive to free Etheria from the evil forces of Horda. <laughs> Hurry, children. Our school has two very special visitors today. Class, I'd like you to meet... Adora and Bo. They've come to tell us some things about the Horde and the Rebellion. Thank you, Serena. Um, I know you've been told... Cory, late again? Sorry. Please excuse the interruption, Adora. Uh, go ahead. Your teacher has already told you that Etheria was not always ruled by the Horde. Before they came, this was a lovely, peaceful planet. That's what? not true! Corey, please don't interrupt. That's all right. Um, I'd like to answer. It's the truth, Corey. The Horde invaded Etheria and took away our freedom, our liberty. That's a lie! The Horde says that they came here because they were invited. They brought peace to Etheria. That's a Horde lie. I used to believe their lies, too. You see, I was a member of the Horde until I found out what they were really like. Uh-oh. And here they are. We'll be back another day to tell you some more truths. Teach only from official horde books. As for your books, they're only good for one thing to burn. Oh, no! Oh, no! You're letting a door and bow get away! <laughs> Always glad to oblige. Bo, give me a big push. One giant swing coming up. Repeat, 
all books. You will bring them here to the town square by noon tomorrow. I am also appointing a new teacher for the school. This is Tom. Hooray for the horse! Good boy. I'll talk to you later. My lieutenant in charge of the book collecting will be... Rattler. Have you anything to say to the people? Rattler says you'd better do as you're told. Or you will be sorry. Tell me, young man. How would you like to be a horde spy? You bet! What would I do? Watch for traitors and rebels. Send secret messages. Wow! You'll make your reports to tongue with this transmitter. Yes, sir! You can't fight that robot, Sarah. Come to my house tonight. I have some books we can read. And so in spring, the flowers bloomed all over the mountains. And Etheria was a peaceful and happy planet. Then the horde invaded and everything changed. That's the truth, children. No matter what lies the horde tells you, next week I'll read you something from another book. the teacher's house, just as I reported, and they have a book! <gasps> oh, oh, what are you doing here? This is my house. Quiet, you're under arrest. Take her away and burn the books. teacher in jail, so there's only one thing to do. For the honor of Grayskull! going to get you out of there. Oh, never mind about me. How are the children? They're safe. Now stand back. All right, Swifty. Pull! I'm sorry, Serena. <gasps> Without books, there will be nothing to prevent the Horde from teaching the children lies. The Horde is really your friend. The Horde wants peace. The rebels are really bad. They're criminals, bandits, thieves, and robbers. No, that's not true. Whoever said that, stand up. Stand up, I said. I said it. No, uh, I said it. No, I said it. I, I, I did. I said it. Stop it. Stop it. I'll 
send you all to school in the fright zone. Do you think he means it? I don't know, but we'd better tell Adora. I'm following two rebel lovers to their camp. You were very brave to come here and tell us, Sarah and Brian. Do you think the Horde will really take away all the children? Not if we can help it. The rebels are planning to come to town and rescue the children. Right. Thanks, Corey. We'll be ready for them. of Northland. The generous horde is once again coming to your aid. Because your school is not good enough for your children, we are sending them to a special horde school. No! We don't want them to go to your school. Troopers, clear the square. In the fright zone, these children will believe any lies we tell them. As I reported, the rebels will be here any minute. Good work, Corey. Help! Help! Mommy! Daddy! That sounds like Ariane! Corey, don't let them take me! Stop! You can't take her! She's my sister! Hey! You have to let my sister go! We have to let her go? Says who? I say so! I'm a member of the Horde, and I... You? A member of the Horde? <laughs> we used you, boy. But we don't need you anymore. You can go with the other children. Put him in the transport. No! You can't do that! Never mind. He's not important. A member of the Horde. <laughs> see the Horde for what it really is. They don't care about people, but the rebels do. They will save the children. Oh, no! The Horde knows they're coming! They've set a trap! How do you know that? Because I'm the one who told them! We've got to warn the Dora! All the troopers are around in front. We can get into the transport by that rear door. All right, then, let's go. It's unlocked. Come on. They must be in another part. Come on. Let's look here. before they see you. No! All right, close it up. It's time to go. Who, who's there? Who is it? Corey, what are you doing here? I came to help. It was my fault you got caught. All right, can you get me my sword? I think I saw it outside. Be careful. You've been very brave, but now it's time for you to go home. Aww. Can I help some more? The way you can help the most is to go home and take care of your family. All right, Adora, whatever you say. For the honor of Grayskull! Thank 
Ponce. We can't just stop them. The children might get hurt. Hey, what's going on? Must be a detour. Turn right. Hey, it's a dead end. There's no way out. Something's wrong here. Better back up. Surprise! End of the line, boys. Hey, it's Shira. Back up quick. Can't get out. Doors jammed. Shira, you arrived just in time. Glad to be here, but we have to do something about Tongue, Rattler, and the rest of the troopers. No, no, no! She did it again. Shira did it again. She made the horde look like fools. She didn't have me to deal with, and now she does. Uh-oh, Hordak. And unless the rebels surrender, and you bring back the children to me, we will destroy your homes, your whole village. We'll burn it to the ground, and I'll give you a sample right now. Let's go find some water. There's what we need. What are you going to carry that water in, Shira? A very big bowl. help to put out that fire. Uh-oh, here comes trouble. Here comes rain. your tongue to yourself. That's not funny, she -Rock. Untie me! <laughs> now that's what I'd call tongue tie. What's the matter with them? Rust. The rain has rusted the robots. <laughs> <laughs> all the fun, Adora. I'm sure you were magnificent, Bo. Well, uh, I was rather good. Of course, Shira helped, too. Looks like the people are going to haul the Hordesmen to the edge of the Fright Zone and dump them, along with Hordak. I bet he won't be back here for a long time. You're quite a hero, Cory. I'm sorry I caused you so much trouble, teacher. I didn't know the truth about the Horde. 
Oh, guess it was because I wasn't very good about reading. I'd like to be your friend, if you want. Me too. Maybe we can help you with your reading. Hey, I'd like that. I'd like it a lot. Hi, it's me, Lucky. Did you find where I was hiding? If not, take another look. See me here? Here I am. You know, sometimes we don't appreciate things until they're taken away from us. Take books, for instance. It would be terrible if they were taken away. Being free to read anything we wish is a right we must never lose. Bye now! 